How you going guys? Steve here again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7 and another build video for me coming up. So I'm super pumped, excited, getting addicted to these. So what we have here is a G-Made Sawback 110 scale uh, four-wheel drive kit. Uh, I love these ones because obviously it's like Tamiya, you, can, you have to put them all together which uh, I enjoy just as much as driving them. So happy days. Now what I have here all the parts here are the electronics and hop-up parts that I already have for this vehicle. So, uh, yeah, so while I'm building it, I'll just upgrade it straight away. Okay, so as you've seen in my previous video, I just bought this Flysky FS GG3B uh, radio. Cheap, works well, hackable, and uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun, and it works perfectly. So from a three-channel, a few mods, you can make it... Uh, an eight channel radio, so happy days. Next up, these great quality uh, Savic servos here. Always recommend these, waterproof, and it's plenty uh, strong enough for the smaller tires for this model. So, Savox uh, SW0231MG. <coughs> Next up, Novak. Uh, Eager 2S slash 3S crawler system for brushed uh, motors only. I have this in my Tamiya Mountain Rider. It works fine. Uh, works great actually. It's fully programmable and uh, I, I, you know, I, I recommend them. Now this one, as opposed to the one in Tamiya kit, was just the actual BSC. This one actually comes with a motor as well. So pretty cool. Great little setup. 35 turn, which is, will be great for this kit. Uh, as Tamiya has got a, th a three speed transmission, this doesn't, so it's just a single gear. So that'll be plenty enough great for the, uh, the model. And there's all the, there's the brain. Comes with a fair bit of parts in here. Nice stickers as well, which is always good. Can have, can't have enough stickers. Okay, moving on. More electric parts. Or with electronics, sorry. Hobby King uh, 2.4 uh, gigahertz, obviously, six channel digital receiver. These are cheapest chips, about 12 bucks. Work great. I have them in all my models, so yeah, can't beat these. Okay, some few upgrades. I've got a chassis mounted steering servo kit. You can get these of us of RC Mart or actually G Made. Have their own uh, site there as well. I think I had to get this from there because they didn't have any in stock at RC Mart. Also, these two go together hand in hand because this is a aluminium zero Ackerman knuckle arm. And if you change these up, you actually need to change actual steering rods as well. So you can't just buy this and use the stock ones. You have to get the other aftermarket ones as well. But all G made. And then RCMR. what else we got here? We got the the bucket light set kit. So obviously you can I want to put some lights in here, make a bit look a bit more realistic, and uh, yeah, nicer than the original ones you get with the kit. So that's that. Um, that's pretty much it. What I have so far. So next uh, video I'll start getting into the the manual and have fun. Thanks again, guys. Appreciate support. See you in the next video.